team is facing a lot of adversity early when it comes to injuries. How do you guys go about overcoming them? Guys just step up. That's it. You know, we got a, you know, deep farm system, deep organization. And, you know, when guys go down, you know, everyone's ready to step up and, you know, fill their spot. You know, especially when, you know, hearing about G, you know, being out and, you know, other guys. But, you know, guys just step up and fill that role. You know, that's the job. Do you feel for Andrew It sounds like his might be a little bit more serious than the rest with the small tear in his labrum. Yeah, it's a tough one. That's a tough one, you know, especially the labrum. You know, those are those are complicated. You know, anything in the shoulder is pretty complicated. But, um, you know, we'll, we'll see how it turns out. Uh, you know, but he's a strong, he's a tough individual. You know, he'll fight through it, you know, no matter how long it is, how short it is. Man, he's going to come back, you know, stronger than ever. So um, he's got someone to step up. And do you feel do you feel confident that this team has enough to, to continue to get the job done without all those guys, nine guys now on the IL? Yeah, stuff like this happens. This is where we really test, you know, test teams. And, uh, you saw it in spring training how deep our team is, you know, especially when you have those guys come in, you know, in spring training. But, yeah, we'll just see who comes up, fills a hole, and, you know, steps up for us. Think it all with two on, it might be safer to let it drop. No, I told Gardner right before that play that I was going to dive and make a play right there. So, um, you know, I just had to do my job. That was it. How does that feel compared to hitting a big home run in a key spot when you make that catch in such an important moment? How do they compare at all? They're pretty close. You know, I love, I love making plays on defense for my pitcher. You know, anytime he's out there working, you know, I want to you know, I want to give 110 percent, you know, just like he is. So anytime you make a play like that and, you know, try to save some runs or make something happen, that's, that's always a pretty good, pretty good feeling. And not as not as close as hitting a homer or something like that, but it's it's close. Now, when you guys dealt with serious injuries last year, you were out, Stan was hurt for, you know, a while. Can you kind of draw on, on those experiences as a team, do you think, in, in, in dealing with what you're going through right now? Yeah, yeah, like I was saying, you know, just guys got to step up, you know, not only the guys in the lineup, but the guys that we have coming up to fill those holes. You know, make sure those guys step up. And, you know, the biggest thing is when you got, we're well, well oiled machine. You know, everyone's doing their part and, you know, just, just doing their job, you know, we're going to be pretty well. So that's all we need is, you know, guys step up and just, just fill those holes. Aaron, did you have any concerns with your catch there with your wrist? Oh, we're good. No concern. No concern. No concern. Yeah, those ones are tough, but uh, you know, I wasn't really thinking about that at the time. I was just thinking about trying to catch it, and that was to see what happens. When did you say that to Guardy? What, what made you think the ball was coming to you? Just, just watching swings throughout the game. You know, what, um, how he's swinging it, you know, especially with O up, what might happen. You know, he's got a good, good off-speed pitch, so he might get around one and, you know, hook one. So I was just, you know, letting Guardy know that, you know, heads up here. So.